Hey guys, uh, so I wanted to talk about a topic today that's uh, pretty important to me. It's something that I've been involved in since I left on my big trip in my early 20s, and it's personal development. And, um, you know, for men, I feel like personal development is kind of a taboo subject. I think men are, you know, always supposed to portray this image of being strong and like they have everything figured out. And the idea of personal development is kind of, it seems weak and it seems like something for someone who's, you know, spiraling or doesn't know what's going on with their lives, there's no direction. But the exact opposite is true. Um, in my 20s, I joined a men's group uh, and it was based around David Data's The Way of the Superior Man. And I hate the word superior. I'm a Jew, so there's definitely, um, you know, tinges of uh, Nazi Germany when you think of the word white superiority, you know, any type of racial superiority sucks and I'm, I'm totally against. But personal self-superiority I think is important and mastering the self and becoming the best self you can for those around you I think is super important. And yeah, I think especially recently men have been kind of put into this category of, you know, the least important, like we've had our time, you know, I, I hear that like 20 times a day in LA that uh, men should step aside and we should, you know, let other people have the limelight. But the reality is that we're still people and we still are important to the community and whether people like it or not, if we don't develop ourselves, that's going to actually be a really bad thing for everyone. So the personal development that I've really been into recently, which I never really was into, was uh, self-care and just like overall looking better, feeling better, and really like hacking my schedule to make sure that I feel amazing. And all that started with fragrances. So <laughs> real manly topic here. But honestly, there's really nothing uh, more manly than smelling good. And this is actually a really manly fragrance. It's called The One by Dolce & Gabbana. I just picked this up yesterday. I've gotten six bottles in the past like three months, so I'm kind of addicted. Um, I think there's also this olfactory kind of muscle memory with scents. This one smells a lot like YSL Lemon, which is kind of a sweet, juicy, but also like vanilla-y and like Ambroxan, which is this kind of airy um, note that happens on the dry dock. But um, yeah, I mean, when you kind of cloak yourself in a scent that you like and that makes you feel happy, uh, it just like brightens your mood and makes your day better. It's kind of like sunshine. We're all sad when the sun's not out, but when it's there, we're a lot happier. And then the same with spraying fragrances. So, um, spray for you. <laughs> and uh, yeah, I mean, I've really, I've probably watched over a thousand hours of fragrance content in the past few months. Like. It's just uh, addictive, I don't know why. I think it's kind of like food blogs. Um, you know, you kind of imagine how they smell. People are super descriptive. This has like a really bright, um, juicy top note. And then the mid note gets a little more vanilla -y and cardamom and it kind of boils down into a sweeter, more rich scent. And then the, the uh, what's it called? The base note is very airy and just, it's a nostalgic scent, like it's, it's a, um, it's a base note that's in a lot of fragrances that I've used when I was younger. And this is kind of the more grown up version of that. So, starting with fragrance, it's led me into skincare, fashion, just making sure everything fits perfect, making, you know, I'm kind of wearing not the best outfit right now. But um, yeah, my skin is totally cleared up just from doing like really simple skincare stuff that, you know, men it's like this is stuff that men are not expected to think about and i feel like it's like this term metrosexual is kind of like a demeaning word for men that actually just want to improve themselves and present the best version of themselves to the world and men these days are you know labeled as slobs and creeps and all the above so i'm really just trying to prove the world wrong that we too are you know clean upright healthy citizens so um yeah go men <laughs> and go everyone else but um i'm a man so that's my focus and hopefully a lot of my followers resonate with that so go get the one it's delicious it smells good i'm gonna spray one more for the road all right see you guys